The following is a technical analysis on crude oil, West Texas Intermediate Futures based upon the daily interval, and investors, traders, and hedge fund managers are becoming increasingly hesitant to show a bearish stance in the stock market as they anticipate a recession or vast majority of the banks have now upticked their recession odds. And instead, they're shifting their bearish bets to the commodity sector, especially energy, where bullish bets have dropped to a record low where hedge funds and money managers sold off 110 million barrels in key petroleum futures and option contracts within the week ending August 6th with positions now heavily skewed towards bearishness, the oil market's recession-focused trades have become overcrowded and susceptible to a reversal with the recent price uptick that some fund managers are buying back short positions to secure profits and possibly establishing new long positions in anticipation of a short covering rally and a dimin diminishing recessionary threat. And I believe we're trading within a key pivotal juncture based upon the 80-20 price resistance level in correlation of its megaphone bullish megaphone pattern and that has been a key telling point for any significant daily interval traders for quite some time now with an unfilled and unchecked gap down below the 7684 price support in correlation of its 7722 price support off the monthly interval that is a big key level to watch especially for any short sellers who are beginning to pile in at the top of this primary downtrend line off the megaphone dual price resistant pattern with now the 50 day moving average being undercut here that is what you would call an aggressive short trade setup to the downside to retarget and rechallenge the 7722 price support, ultimately taking that level out on a rechallenging and or revisit of the 7262 price support level based upon the primary reactionary uptrend line with major reactionary lows across that entire sphere there. And that will be the biggest telling point, in my opinion, for any indicator to suggest we are slipping into a recession, a big break to solid daily infused red candle close below that key inflection point issue in that potential recessionary indicator that crude oil's demand is starting to diminish with haste and a commodity bear market begins to ensue with acceleration short sellers do not want to see a breakout above this primary megaphone pattern on a rechallenging of this primary reactionary downtrend line off the october major reactionary highs here and that is a big key level of price resistance in correlation of its 8167 price resistance and any short sellers going on for a ultimate you would call an ultimate stop loss ratio up to the four call it five and a half give you a little bit some room above the 83 86 price support level gunning for the first target at 76 84 for a three percent crash and then ultimately crashing down below that air park pocket down to on a rechallenging of the primary reactionary uptrend line and 72 dollars support for an eight percent crash and down below and beyond long traders bull traders they want to see a final big solid breakout above this primary reactionary uptrend line ultimately taking this level out in correlation of the 80-20 price resistance and rechallenging the primary reactionary downtrend line, which I would only suspect a ton of shorts, uh, stops to go off, a lot of shorts to get squeezed out, ultimately taking out the 83-86 price level would put the Joe Biden master crude oil trade in jeopardy on a rechallenging of the big 86-13 price monthly price interval and then ultimately $87 up on top would uh, spell for a big large mega rally to the upside only squeezing uh, and or technical short trade setups that begin to get stopped out with infuriating at an infuriating pace make no mistake about it some of these key technical momentum indicators you have a bullish crossover in the moving average convergence you have a stochastics 1033 surging with momentum maintaining above its 85 healthy standard strength of momentum as an early indicator and you do have confirmed rsi divergence here only making the bull case once again i would only consider this a very aggressive short trade setup to the downside if not the most valuable short trade coming off the neck of the primary uptrend line downtrend line for a major move to the downside as well as the 8386 price resistance would be the most favorable risk reward short trade setup zone that i've seen in quite some time and upon that previous crude oil west texas technical analysis video that i had created I had mentioned how pivotal it was off the 86.13 price resistance level to begin the scaling in process of shorting crude oil and the entirety of that trade from the top of that scaling in process back tested off the primary reactionary uptrend line was good for a 14.7% crash to the downside, especially if you're following these key technical levels, short sellers covered right at the bottom of the uptrend line and the 72.62 price support level. 
and begin bidding to the upside on a complete gap up over its 200 day moving average for 11 percent 11.6 percent in gains make no mistake about it this in the near term is a short trade setup skewed to the downside for the risk reward ratio call it an aggressive short trade setup here ultimately some stops to go off setting some tight stops up above to gear in to hit this 7684 price support level and ultimately a rechallenging of the primary reactionary uptrend line do not underestimate how quickly the front end of the curve and disinflationary forces could attack crude oil in an all-out halt in demand and an oversupply in black gold